And Alex, uh, you've got a really interesting story. I know that uh, obviously you've taken yourself off to Mexico to, to challenge yourselves, to really take yourself out of your comfort zone. You've done the same in Canada. What can we expect now that you're back in the UK? Um, an explosive style, uh, Mexican style, pressure, uh, pick my punches. Yeah, you're going to see a great performance. And just give us a bit of insight into what it's like as a young man taking yourself off to go and train in the gyms of Mexico City and train with the likes of you know, Marquez. I believe um, if you want to be anything in life, you've got to sacrifice. And those sacrifices make me a much better fighter and a much better individual. Thanks, a super featherweight contest scheduled for 10 three minute rounds of boxing. Firstly, to make his way to the scales, boxing out of Prague in the Czech Republic, please welcome Martin Cracker Palagi. Nine stone, three pounds, two ounces. Nine stone, three pounds, two ounces. Originally born in Red Hill, Surrey, please welcome Alex Hildegarni. A 19 fights as a professional boxer, 18 wins. Nine stone, three pounds even. Martin Barlage and Alex Delmagande. Interesting to see how Dil Magani has developed. A lot of good sparring, obviously, in Mexico. He's been boxing over in Canada. And just to go around those Mexican gyms and, and get the sparring and get the, the respect of the Mexican fighters, which apparently he did. That, that's, a, that's great experience, it really is. And really looking forward to see how he's going to develop and how he's come up. And now to make his ring walk to the red corner from Crayford, Kent, Alex. Dilmagani! Well, what to make of Alex Dilmagani? Nick Hennessy calls him the best kept secret in boxing. And after his spell in Mexico, has he turned into a different fighter? Time now for a international super featherweight contest. So over to you, Alex Dilmagani. Can he make a statement here? Both of Martin Parlaghi's defeats came in the UK. Both of those fights, he scored a knockdown, he cut his opponent. And he's going to be an all-quit test here for Dil Magani. There's a lot on the line here for Dil Magani, Richie. It's, it's quite a positive start from Dil Magani. Just measuring the distance and gap again with that lead right hand of his. Mexican style, actually, as he's coming forward on that front foot. Nice high guard. Prepared probably to take a shot to land one. Palagi he's certainly he's landing the ball here and there. Oh. Il Magani's digging to the body as well and testing Palagi's fitness here and conditioning. Trying to block the shots that are coming back. There's that left uppercut downstairs. It's a good shot. <coughs> certainly in control now here, Dil Magani. It's just that sense of relentlessness, isn't it? Every time you look up, they're standing in front of you, and that's what Dil Magani's done here with.
win. A stoppage for Alex Dilmagani. A good performance and a good win. Your winner and win at number 19 of his professional career, Alex Dilmagani. Dilmagani after a great performance here, Victoria Warehouse. Um, strange sort of circumstances how it ended, but you know, that's just one of them things in boxing. But can you just talk us through? Great win, I thought. It was against, it, against a tough kid there who hadn't been stopped. He's only lost two contests in the 28 that he's had.